morning guys it is Friday and I feel like I'm winning for the day already it's 8 30 I got up a little before 7 um, and we had gotten back in this bad habit of not getting up until 9 uh, between the time change and we started sports in the evenings um, so getting home later getting to bed later we just we're naturally waking up a little later so <clears throat> And I'm just getting over being sick, and Brayden is now sick. I think both of the little boys have had a touch of it and are getting over it. Um, <clears throat> so today I made a conscious effort to get out of bed early. I got my Bible study done, and um, my Bible journaling, and all of that, and took a shower and blow dried my hair. And when I got out of the shower, both of the little boys were up, which is weird because it was 8 o'clock. Um, so now I'm going to start some breakfast and get everybody fed and get back on a really good routine again. It's like the story of my life. Like, get on a routine and um, things come along and knock us out of our routine. So I have a little straightening to do in this kitchen. I'm going to make some breakfast and we'll take you guys along with us. Pancakes, it's cooking. Hold on. It's cooking. It's cooking. Be Wait a minute. Gotta be patient. Excuse me, your head. Gonna use our paper plates. Excuse me, everybody's head. Everybody's head. Watch out, everybody's head. We're not gonna pull out a, a plate for ourselves yet. It's not ready. Excuse me. Mommy's learning more patience today with cooking with a two and four year old. Because Lord knows you need a lot of patience for that. Right, Hunter? Do we need patience? Oh, I'm going to put seeds in this, chili beans in this, and we had to shake it. Mm -hmm. You did that at the library, didn't you? At story time. And you shake it. Mm -hmm. And you made an instrument with beans and paper plates? Yeah. yeah, that's fun. Okay, it's time to flip our pancakes. When I do cook something for the kids, I've been trying to make extra and put it in the freezer um, so that on days when they just want a little extra snack or if I have three or four bags of pancakes made up, um, one morning I don't have to cook. And I don't I'm just not one of those people. I love Jim Morrell, how she can have, you know, two whole days devoted to freezer cooking. I just am not able to do that. I don't have the freezer space. 
um, to do that, but when I can make a little extra and have a little extra um, in the freezer, that's great. So, just one of my little tips. What are we going to play? Public school. Public school. <clears throat> so, um, I have been getting in the habit of, since we've been staying up later, to make sure the house is picked up before we go to bed, and we did not do that last night. So we're gonna do a quick cleanup of the living room, and then we're gonna play public school. Does that sound fun? Yes, except in the school. So. Do we get playtime including? Yes. Thank you. <clears throat> so you I just thought it would be fun today to have them um, hurry up and get dressed and brush your teeth and get out of your pajamas and get your backpack and we'll play school. So. Um, fun way to sneak in some learning again. Um, so we'll see you guys in a little bit. Is Madison Bowden here? Is Hunter Bowden here? Is Isaac Bowden here? Are you here? There's rain on there. Can you go sit? Okay, we ready? I'm going to be a police officer. Move Bailey. Bailey wants to hear the story too. My name is Michelle. This is my mom. This is my dad and my big brother, David. We live David. In, we live in this house. Where's David? There's David. There's the house. I'm my dad. dad is a police officer. Okay, go to the next line and try that one. Follow the line. So this is really good practice for beginner writers who are just learning how to make um, letters and stuff. This book came in something we got from Sam's Club, like a kindergarten. Can I show them the front when you're done? A kindergarten kit thing. So it's a school zone, tracing phone. Okay, do this one. Can you do the little humps and then they get bigger? So this is good practice for Hunter, who's four, who's just learning how to write letters. Good try. Okay, start up here at the arrow and follow the trail all the way around until you get the bunny and the carrot. Doing good. Start at the top. Trace. So get right here and trace the square. Just gotta go real slow. Trace the little square in the middle. Good job. Can you trace the oval? Just go real slow. Hold the paper with your other hand so it'll be still. Good. Trace the big oval. How's it going, man? That's right. What'd you do? That's right. Why are you erasing it? 49 is bigger than 36. And 79 is bigger than 34. You did right. This one, let's look at this one. What's bigger, 29 or 30? 29. 29 is bigger, why? Because it's last and 30. Can I have to waste? Yeah, but you're supposed to have the alligator mouth open to the bigger number. Ooh. It goes 28, 29, Can 30. Yeah, hold on. 30 is bigger. Right? Is 30 bigger? Yeah, I didn't know that. Okay. What's bigger, 29 or 30? It's really good coloring, Isaac. I need to keep this. Okay, you keep that. Good job. Okay, you want to do something else? Mm -hmm. Let's see, you want to go back and redo these? Was this fun? That was boring. That was boring? 
Wipe it off. Mommy will hold this. You clean off the page. Make I, it all shiny and new. I would like to do that. You did that last year well, when I you were in preschool. But you already know how to do it. But I want to do it again. Okay, maybe when you're done with your real school. Okay, finish your math. It says 53 uh, equals how many tens plus how many ones? 50 plus 3. So how many tens do you have in 53? Well, 10, mommy, 20, 30, 40, 5, so put 5 tens. How many ones do you have? And then over here it says equals 50 plus 3. Okay, 36. How many tens do you have? Hold your pencil the right way. Three tens plus how many ones? Hold your pencil the right way so you can write right. Mm -hmm. Equals what? Thirty. So you can write write. Plus six, right? So write thirty. Three zero. So you can write right. So you can write correctly. Mm -hmm. Plus six. Is that right? Why are you holding your pencil so funny? Try this one by yourself. I can't. Why can't you? Maddie and Chloe are doing um, Art for Kids Hub. They're drawing, drawing. Yes, I'll push play. And Hunter was playing basketball and now he is flopping around on the ground. And Braden's sick reading in his bed. I'm supposed to be fixing the vacuum, but we'll see. They got tired of playing outside. They had a snack. No, they're doing art. If you guys haven't um, checked out this YouTube channel before, it's Art for Kids Hub. And it's awesome. It's step-by-step -step drawing on how to draw different stuff, and they really enjoy doing it. Bring it back. We get out of the ants. There's ants everywhere. Bring it here. Bailey. <laughs> Bring me your rope. Give me your rope. You don't want me to throw it? He just wants to run with it. He's just happy to run.